Pueblo. Tucson, Arizona is the site for this exciting matchup. Let's head down to the coin toss now. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calorie. Enjoy everything. Both teams are on the field, and we're just about ready to open things up. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. And he just got stood up right there. Flag on the play. Let's see what it is. Receiving team. So they'll move back after that costly penalty, and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. He's on the run, and he's going to come up with a sack. Boy, big-time call by the defensive coordinator, bringing the blitz from the corner. One thing to bring a linebacker or a safety, but when you bring the corner, you're really taking a chance because if the quarterback recognizes that, it's kind of an easy pass. That time, the quarterback didn't see him and allowed the corner to get home and make the sack. Second down, about 12 yards to go. Ball on the 12-yard line. at the 23-yard line. They pick up good yardage that time on the pass play. Here they kind of put pressure on the quarterback and challenged him to find the hole in the defense. And in this case, he did. Nice job. Slings it. And down he goes around the 39-yard line. You like the faith he has in his receiver to just put the ball up and let him go get it. From their own 39-yard line, it's first down. Throws middle to the tight end. Tackle made around the 47-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. And he hits him hard at the 48. That'll make it third and one. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He's taken down around the 42-yard line. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. Tackled after a decent pickup. This is the eighth play of this drive. strike and he can't pull it in so it's third down now and they're going to need about four they'll line up with five wide receivers he's tackled the 24 yard line i love to see this quarterback respond when this offense really needs him to pick him up your quarterback's performance on third down is vital to your team's success. And this is the 10th play of the drive. They go to the back, and he's hit immediately in the backfield. From the 27-yard line, second down. Got an opening. 
gets to about the 24-yard line. So they pick up three on the option keeper. That makes it third and 11. Here's the 12th play of the drive. Nearly intercepted. This just shows you that you don't need to be sacking the quarterback to disrupt the passing game. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. Arizona could take the lead with this field goal. It's up, and he just drilled it from long range. Yeah, he got some good leg behind it, and he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. 3 nothing, Arizona. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. He gets to about the 34-yard line. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. They'll bring him down at the 44. Knocked out of bounds at the 36. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Slings it out and it gets tipped. Right, I thought the quarterback put the ball there where it could have been caught. The receiver's got to do a better job of fighting for the football. When that ball is up in the air and it's between a defender and a receiver, I think the receiver's got to show more effort and a willingness to fight for the football. The safety just knocked that ball away from him. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. That's good for a gain of four yards. That makes it first and ten. From the 32-yard line, first down. the stop around the 34-yard line. The defensive end came through to put him away. Nice job of utilizing his athletic ability to get in there and then make a sure tackle. Fires quickly and he's got his man. He's at the 20. Knocked out of bounds at about the 17-yard line. From the 17 yard line. First down. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. So he decides to hold on to it, and that's going nowhere. Boy, the senior linebacker's experience really showed on that run. He sniffed it out perfectly and made the tackle. This is the ninth play of this drive. He makes it to the 15-yard line. They'll line it up again on third down. He fires right. Incomplete pass. This unit has quick hands, and they showed it there by knocking away the pass.
Mississippi State is looking to tie things up. Kicks up, and he got it. They line up to kick this one away. He sends this one deep. He's to the 20. They'll bring him down at the 27. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. They'll spread the field with five wide. Tackle at the 40. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. First and 10. Ball on their own 40. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Field. And he's tackled at about the 43 yard line. From the 43 yard line, it's first down. They go to the ground game. It's a fumble. And they fall on the loose ball. The running back won't be happy that he lost the ball. He's got to forget about it and get ready for the next series. His offense is going to need him again. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. It's the tailback. Looking for the corner. He gets hit out of bounds around the 44-yard line. Second down and five. Ball on the 44-yard line. Nice run there. The halfback picks up maybe five yards on the draw play. That'll bring up third and inches. Go to the left for a nice game. Gain of seven yards. First down. From the 32-yard line. First down. Nice run up the middle. Marks gets six yards on the play. That'll make it second and four. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. He goes out of bounds around the 21-yard line. Pass complete there for about five yards and a first down. And that's just great execution on that short pass play. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 21. They bring him down in the backfield. He just timed the snap count there and really made a nice play. Setting up blockers, the running back's got it on the screen. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. He throws right. 
Fires quickly, and he's got his receiver for the touchdown. Nicely designed play to the wide receiver, and it got him six. You said it, Brad, and a good time to call it. I tip my hat to the offensive coordinator. You've always got to be on your toes when you're covering this guy. And he tacks on the extra point. So an eight-play, 50-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. The score now, 10-3. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Bulldogs are smothering the opposition so far today. What's this offense got to do to get off the schneid? Right? Well, you talk to offensive coordinators about that, and they'll say we've got to find our go-to guy. Who are our players that we know we can count on, and what are the plays that we typically feel the most confident about? That's usually where the offenses tend to go when they're getting shut down like this. He lost the ball. One of the wide receivers picks up the fumble. And the booth is going to take a few looks at this to see whether or not the ball came out before he was down. They're going to review this fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball popped loose. I don't know about this one, Brad. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need indisputable video evidence to overturn this call. After, After reviewing review the, the play, the ruling, the ruling on the field, the field is reversed. reversed. So the booth and the referee agree. The runner's knee was down. That was still a close call, though, Brad. Even though he was down, this guy has to do a better job of holding that football. Brought down at about the 45. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. So at the end of one quarter, Mississippi State leads it 10-3. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. And he's taken down at the 46-yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. Third down. So it's third down, and they're just inches away from picking up the first down. Get to that quickly. You know, the screen pass is used more often than not when the defense is putting pressure on the quarterback. When they feel this is the time that they can get after the quarterback, whether that's a, a blitz situation or it's third down and long, when they really feel like this is the play we're going to get after the quarterback, and the offense is able to sniff it out and get the screen pass off right over top of the blitz, and then you have either a receiver or running back waiting there to make a big play, and he's got a convoy of linemen in front of him that didn't have to worry about the pressure, but now you talk about a big play for the offense. From the 36-yard line, first down. Now he tries to buy some time. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. He scrambled. Runs with it, and he's got room. And down he goes at about the 29-yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. And they get nice yardage on that run. Third down has been the charm on this drive. Now it's been all about execution. When it comes to calling the right play at the right time, they've been able to do it here. 
We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 23-yard line. Tackle made at the 25-yard line. Did you see how that big defensive line got such a good push on that play? That's exactly why they were able to stop him for a loss. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Throws it out, and it falls incomplete. Well, they'll line it up again on third down. Two for two so far on this drive. Quick out to his receiver. He's taken down around the 23-yard line. That'll be a two-yard gain. It was a nice catch by the sophomore, but it was well played by the defense to stop him for a minimal gain. Kicks away, and they tack on three points. Arizona kicked this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Mississippi State holds a four-point lead. He's tackled at the 47. That's a game. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 47-yard line. They'll bring him down at the 41-yard line. Number 20 makes the set at the 41-yard line. That'll make it second and four. tackled right away. It's complete for about four yards and a first down. Nothing special here. Quick pass and a good catch, but it keeps the chains moving. First and ten. Ball on the 37. Finds his man. First down. his way to the seven yard line the reason why it's so crucial to be able to run effectively like this is it keeps the defense guessing they have no idea whether you're passing or running even if you need medium to long range yards it's first down and they'll be looking for six points here and he's tackled after positive yardage Mississippi State is up four. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Touchdown, Bulldogs! And he adds the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You know, this offense is doing a pretty good job moving the football. The problem is they're not coming up with touchdowns. 
The offensive coordinator who's been up here next to us, Brad, the booth next to us, he's actually just taken off his headsets, and I think he's going down to the field to be next to the quarterback and the rest of this offense to try to engage with them to realize how important it is to finish these drives. And they make the stop right around the 40. He gets another set of downs and, more importantly, opens up a whole host of play calling possibilities for the coaching staff. From their own 40-yard line, it's first down. He's into the open field. He gets to about the 41-yard line. From the 41-yard line, first down. Makes it out to about the 30. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Got a man, but he's tackled back behind the line of scrimmage. Loss of a yard. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated them there. From the 31-yard line, second down. He's going to try and scramble. Now he's going to run and watch out. Good open field tackle. They'll get the first down. He made the correct decision to tuck it and go. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 19. And he has it on the corner. He makes it out to maybe the 16-yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. in the middle tackle at the 13 about three yards that time on the screen they'll line up for the field goal and this is nothing more than a chip shot and they can make this a one possession game with this kick right here the kick is up and it's through the uprights and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. The last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And he's tackled at the 38. First down. From their own 38 yard line. First down. Mississippi State holds an eight point advantage. Just throws this one away. immediately tackled. That's a that makes it first and ten. Hey, 
from the 43 yard line. It's first down. Here's the pass, broken up. That was almost intercepted by the cornerback. That's incredible speed by that corner, but also the quarterback kind of helped in there by putting a little bit too much air under it. Just throws this one away. Third down now, they need to get it down to the 33. Pass is caught, the defense lays him out. Mississippi State can make this a two possession game with this field goal. Gets it up and it's long enough and it's good. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 25. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Now he's scrambling. Brought down at the 27-yard line. One, maybe two yards on the quarterback scramble. From their own 27-yard line, it's second down. Five wide. He's scrambling. And he's taken down around the 27-yard line. At this point, boys, you're playing against the defense and the clock. So you might want to consider to hurry things up. Quick throw. And down he goes at the 36. from their own 36-yard line. First down. Quick pass. Tackle made right around the 48-yard line. Good job to identify the weakness in this defense. Any good offense will exploit those holes over and over again. He guns it to the right. Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. There's very good chemistry between these two. They like to run through all their routes before the game. And I have to say, they look sharp before this one even started. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 35. Catches it, and that's all. Fires a bullet out to the right, and he stays in bounds to make the catch. the eighth play of this drive. Initially, it was called a catch, but now we're going to find out for sure if he at least had one foot in and possession of the ball before he went out of bounds. After reviewing the play, the ruling on the field is reversed. 
So after the review, the verdict is that it was no catch. They missed it on the field, but that was a bang-bang play. The important thing is they got the call right. Finds his man, and they take him down immediately. They're going to try a long field goal here. And they can make this a one-possession game with this kick right here. The kick is away. It's long enough. And he nails the long field goal. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. Mississippi State up by eight. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Davis, Dave Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. I'm sure both teams have problems in the first half, but one of them, David, not moving the football. Both offenses really ran up and down the field. That we see this more in college football, Reese. More success on the offensive side, and it's harder and harder to stop these offenses that continue to get more and more complicated. Defenses, they got no answer. They got to find an answer quick, or else this ball game is just going to go tick for tack the whole second half. Looking forward to seeing this second half. I think there's certainly a want for victory. A want and a need for victory. Some teams need this victory, Reese Davis. Want, need, got to go get it either way if Brandon Kirk are there to deliver. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Bulldogs having everything going their way right now. They have put up 20 straight points on the board. Both sides have made their way back out, and we're just about set to get going again. Mississippi State is up by eight. He's under some heat, and they get the sack. <laughs> Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he is drilled at the 25-yard line. Seven yards. That brings up third and ten. It's third down and ten. Ball on the 25. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. Tackle made at the 36-yard line. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He's taken down to the 37-yard line. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 37. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. He fights forward to about the 40. Slings it. And they push him out around the 46-yard line. 
That'll bring up fourth and one. And this one is a beauty. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. Not a lot of success for this offense on their last trip out. Mississippi State up by eight. Setting up blockers or running backs. Got it on the screen. He's gobbled up in the backfield. A one-yard loss. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. Second and 11 coming up now. Ball on their own 19. Gains his way to the 30-yard line. That'll bring up third and inches. He's tackled around the 47-yard line. That makes it first and 10. We've got a first and 10. Ball on their own 47. And he's level at the 45-yard line. Mississippi State holds an eight-point advantage. And they make the stop at the 47-yard line. This punt, if he gets it where he wants, it can really change the field position in this football game. Booming kick. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense, as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Nice run up the middle. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. They hand it off. Makes it out to about the 36. And they'll get him in the backfield. Ouch. Pretty big loss on the play, and I think they might want to reassess the strategy here. Perhaps run a screen. Maybe hit the tight end on a short pattern. This D-line is just a bit much to handle at this moment. Man left, man left. So it's second and 14. Ball on the 32-yard line. Mike 14. Mike 14. <laughs> Gains his way to the 46-yard line. Shoved out of bounds at the 35-yard line.
from the 35 yard line. First down. He has some room. Gains his way to the 26 yard line. Off to the right, and he makes it out to about the 24 yard line. From the 24 yard line, it's first down. Tackle at the 24 yard line. No gain. That makes it second and 10. We're at play number nine of this current drive. That's a great tackle at the 27. Really good play here and run support by the linebacker. The big guys up front took away the running lanes and he was able to get through for a loss. From the 27 yard line, third down. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's sacked. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds to this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive lineman and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. Kicks away. Tough break there for the kicking team. And our score, Mississippi State 20, Arizona 12. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Mississippi State is up by eight. And he's tackled at the 48. From the 48-yard line, first down. Tries to set up a screen for the wide receiver. Brought down at about the 37-yard line. Turner with the tackle at the 37-yard line. First down. Makes it out to about the 37-yard line. Nothing going there for the halfback on that option play. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37. Makes it out to about the 20. Quick throw, and he's got the half back again. From the 20-yard line, second down. Mississippi State up by eight. Halfback screen, incomplete. Throw 
Throws quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. Accuracy is such a vital part of being a quarterback. You've got to have an ability to lay the ball right into your guy's hands. It's fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. It's up, and he's got it. They line up to kick this one away. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 26. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And down he goes at about the 27-yard line. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Pitches in, and he's got a lane. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. From the 49-yard line, first down. Complete, he's out of bounds. Throws in the middle. And he's taken down around the 38-yard line. That's three down and one to go. Mississippi State in front by 11. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. Nice gain as he works the right side. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 26. Fires right side, got his tail back. That makes it fourth and twelve. He's looking for six. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. Not sure about that play call as they fail on fourth down. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Rose and it's incomplete. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 38. Gives it right side. Tackle made at the 38. The quarterback in the gun with five receivers. He's taken down around the 50-yard line. You know, having a playmaker at tight end makes those linebackers think twice before they make a move. That could be just enough time for the quarterback. From midfield, 
It's first down. Nice catch, first down, and he's knocked out. That's a gain of 12 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Strike to his receiver, no good. From the 38-yard line, it's second down. He's at the 30, he's at the 20. Huge gain, and that sets him up nicely with a first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. He's tackled at the eight-yard line. This is the ninth play of this drive. hit and taken down. It's third and goal, and they're about four yards out. They've got their goal line sets on the field. This might be a good time for play action. They'll bring him down just outside the goal line. He gets it up, and it is good. Mississippi State ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. Oh, man, he took him down hard. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. Scrambling around. And they make the stop at the 28. The quarterback trying to make a play. Well, he did a nice job of getting some yards there on the scramble, but he needs to learn to slide to avoid those big hits. It's second down, six to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. And off to the left. They go to the left for a nice game. From their own 40-yard line. First down. Wiley takes a handoff. Tackled after a decent pickup. down in the backfield. Third down again. He chucks it downfield. 
The defender had it and then dropped it. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They're ready to begin another drive. Gets it out quickly. Tackle at about the 25-yard line. That brings us second and five. It's second and five here. Ball on the 25. A little counter, but he goes nowhere. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Zips it to the tight end. He's to the 40. He's pushed out of bounds around the 43-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 43-yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. Nice run there. Five yards there for the quarterback. That brings him second and five. They get nice yardage on that run. The defense has got to do a better job of being more aggressive. You know, this offense doesn't seem to be in much of a hurry. They're working the clock. You know the chances are they're going to run the football. That allows the defense to pin their ears back and get aggressive. And it really comes down to the defensive linemen holding up against the offensive line and the linebackers and safeties crashing downhill and making plays against the run game. Heading for the corner. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Johnson gains about four yards on the play. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Makes it out to about the 33. That's a deep nine on the play. From the 33-yard line, first down. He fights forward to about the 30. Three-yard gain by the running back. And this is the 10th play of the drive. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. He makes it to the 28-yard line. in the books in our final score Mississippi State 26 Arizona 12. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreet this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.